how do you check if one string contains another string? Well, there are many ways to do this, but here are a few I like best. First, let's create the strings. One thing that is nice is that we don't have to put the var before both variables. We just have to put it before the first one if we're putting them in a row. So I'm going to show the first way to check if that second string is in the first string is this. And if we run that, you'll see in the console, true, great is in JS Nuggets is great. The way this works is that the index of finds what what position in the original string this the substring is located. So if the word is not in the original string at all, it will return negative one. Otherwise, it will return the, the actual index. This way is the way that is best for performance reasons. But there are other ways to, to do it, including this other one that, that's available in ES6. And if we run this, we can see it's true again. So the word includes is, a, is, is available, is new with ES6, and makes it even quicker to find out if one string includes another string. So if we just change this to bad, let's see if that works. And see, it shows false, false. So those are two ways to check if one string contains another string. Thanks for watching JS Nuggets. My name is Bo Carnes, and the code in this video and links to more resources on the topic are in the description. Don't forget to subscribe, and remember, use your code for good.